some people had big dreams when they were little. As they grew up, they went on to pursue these dreams. Mary Curie was one of them. She became a scientist and went on to win the Nobel Prize twice in her life. Today, I am going to read you this book, Mary Curie. Little People, Big Dreams. When Mary was a little girl, she made a vote to herself. She was going to be a scientist, not a princess. Mary was from a poor family, but she was very smart. At school, she won a gold medal for her studies, which she kept in her drawer like a treasure. May couldn't go to the same university as her brother. In her home country, only men could study. But she wouldn't take no for an answer. So she packed her bags and moved away to France. Even though studying a new language was not easy, Mary soon became the best maths and student in Paris. One day, Mary met Peter and happily, he loved science just like her. Soon, Peter and Mary loved each other too. They married and became Madame and Monsieur Curie. Hidden away in the laboratory, Mary and Peter discovered two incredible things, radium and polonium. It was such a thrilling moment for science. They won a Nobel Prize for their research. Mary became the first woman to receive this honor. One day, Mary suffered a terrible accident and poor Mary was left alone. Mary wiped her tears away and worked harder than ever. The audience applauded loudly the day she was awarded her second Nobel Prize. A terrible war had broken out. Mary's discoveries were used by doctors to help injured soldiers. After the war was over, Many girls followed in Mary's footsteps, studying at her Parisian Institute. She had valuable advice for every new student. In life, there is nothing to be afraid of. Only many things to learn and many ways to help those in need. I hope you enjoyed this story. Thank you.